Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of Europa Universalis for Colonial Prick. My name is Dvoraka, and let's continue. Holy crap, I didn't realize that I got navally invaded up here. Oh, gosh, 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 gosh. I think I need to retreat some of my troops. Uh, how do I go about this? I'm going to retreat this 14k stack and see if I can deal with these Swedish troops. I do have my vassal up here. So getting finished our mission for exploration. We're making seven ducats a month, which is really good. Let's continue exploring and we can grab a, another merchant. What are we going to do with this merchant? I think for the time being, we're going to send him to transfer trade from the North Sea. Yep. So we, make, so we can make some more money. Okay, we need to quickly pick these troops up. He's attacked my vassal, so we need to go help him. I just realized he used the term navally invaded again. <laughs> Another hard to buy in term. Okay, let's go. We need to stop this. We really, really need to stop this. Let's put a leader on this guy. And we will park him right here on the fort. While we're doing this, let's go try and take on these uh, these navies. So they can't do any of this meme crap again. Let's go get the Danish navy. There are navies up here. And we're going to engage him. Very, very nice. Okay, now I think I can come in with my 19k stack. Just so we can put them together. Uh, where is this general? I'm very curious. Ah, oh, he's here. Okay. That's good. Okay, we're going to engage the other fleet now. Uh, our exploration fleet isn't going to engage this fleet of cogs. That's okay. Continue to raise war taxes. Add spy network or diplomatic points. We have... We have a big spy network, so we can just take the diplo points. Let's merge the, the army. And I think that's his main, uh, main fleet smashed. Let's move up and retake some forts. Yeah, he's being a bit of a memer. <laughs> this guy. Okay, now we can come back and blockade this. And we're going to engage this fleet as well, very nice. Even without a leader, we're just smashing their fleets, so that's really, really good. It's the strength of the the, um, the British. Okay, can we press the button? No, because Austria is still the freaking leader of the siege, that's annoying. But we should we be winning it soon, hopefully this tick. Yeah, very nice, okay. Will he accept peace? Not even for one province. Okay, so we need to continue to siege stuff down. So let's split up. We need to keep an eye on the Scottish army because together we can definitely beat these 17, 18, well, 18 to 20,000 troops up here. Siege complete, navy smashed, and let's continue south to siege these provinces down. Our fleet is of no use to us right now, so we can go and take care of this uh, galley, looks like it, actually. We have a couple ships that are going to die, so we should probably repair for the time being. This is the grasslands and here are hills. Let's see what we can do here since his army has already started this siege. The Scottish army is coming down as well. Can we win this battle fast enough? I think we might be able to. 
Low morale, Scotland's coming in. I think this is a good, uh, good battle for us. Yes, very nice. Now let's go finish him off. I think we can ask... Actually, no. Yeah, we can ask allow friendlies to attach. So the Scottish army will st stick with us for the time being. Okay, we have, we're getting invaded again down here. Quickly pull out the fleet and attack. Follow them. Okay, Burgundy still doesn't want peace. He will accept for one province though, but that's that's not what I want. I want to get at least two. Oh, where is he going? He must be going this way. But I'm being blockaded. <laughs> Damn. Bring the fleet back over. The explorer needs to keep exploring. Once again, I'm going to lose lose a ship. It's really annoying. So he can go hide in this province all he wants. I don't care. We might have enough war score once we complete this siege here. That's really nice. My exploration fleet is going to engage. <laughs> that's, that's nice, I guess. I think we can go finish this army off. And then re, uh, re siege everything here. Nice. Instant stack wipe. That's what I like to see. Austria, why? Why did he just move off of the siege? I don't understand. Maybe he wants to go. Okay, right. That makes sense. Can we offer peace with anyone else? Mecklenburg? No. Denmark? No. He has negative 123 and we have 75 reasons. Can we take another piece of land? No, that causes a huge coalition against us. I don't want to be dealing with that. We can grab the next military tech. Very nice. Tell Scotland to stop attaching to me. And split and resiege the Scottish land. I think the music is a little too loud. Let me turn it down for a second. Don't want the unrest, so that's okay. Making five ducats a month right now. We've got three colonies running. Castile hasn't touched anything up here yet. Either has Portugal. They haven't crossed into the new world, so we are the first here. And they haven't gone down here yet. This is Castile's first colony, which he hasn't even completed yet. So we are way, way ahead in terms of colonization. And <laughs> what... Oh, what a sneaky prick. Papal State declared war on Provence. Provence. Okay, I think we have been repairing for long enough. I wonder what's happened with the Burgundian army. He still has 50k troops somewhere, but my 20k stack is just alone here. Uh, we can order a barrage, which we will do. Speed up this process a little bit. Can we... Mecklenburg will accept peace, but I think we won't peace out for the time being. Because that's giving us some extra war score. And we've got Hungary going into Denmark. Okay, this is good. We are being blockaded. By who? Ah, over here. Okay. Uh, we'll take the dip uh, tech cost reduction. Still isn't going to accept peace, but I think he will very, very, very soon. France, I would like him to end his war, because I don't want him to snab any of these provinces here. He does have a claim on Picardy. Okay, we won a siege. Okay, that's... We won the Scottish capital siege. Loth... Lothian, sorry. Lothian, Lothian. Something like that. 
The siege is nearly complete. And he will accept peace. Now, how much money can I get out of you? Oof, that's a lot of money. But I think we're going to play it safe. And just take these two provinces and send them out. Awesome. Get up the autonomy in both provinces. And soon we will definitely look to attack Flanders. How's the elections going? Okay, everyone is voting for Austria, which isn't too good. Austria is annoyed at me due to my aggressive expansion. I think I need to be using every single one of my diplomats to improve relations with outraged people or and or neighbors. Outraged, yes, 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 and outraged. Okay, improve relations so that in the next war we can take more stuff. But right now. Once our troops get reinforced, we should be making quite a good deal of money. Uh, let's grab my fleet and ferry these troops back to the English mainland. We'll keep these forts for now. We can turn these ones off. Take the army back. Do it manually, it's much quicker this way. I find it. And we can start drilling again. Lost a bit of manpower during that war, but it'll trickle back up. We're not going to be doing much in the meantime. Do have a lot of ducats, so I think we can probably safely start another colony here. Actually, no, you come here. How's our force limit? We can make one more unit, so let's make it there. And then we will recall this guy. And send him to the next center of trade, which is Jamaica. Is that Jamaica? I'm pretty sure it's Jamaica. Yeah, it's Jamaica. Okay. Let's see how much money. I think we're going to be losing about five ducats a month, I think, at that point. Once the colonist does arrive, eventually. This guy is ready. Let's send him over to Jamaica. Either way, this, this colony here is nearly, nearly finished. Never know, I might be able to get the no pirates in my uh, Caribbean achievement. Probably want to go for Bermuda as well. Maybe as soon as this finishes, I'll go for Bermuda because that's an easy colony to take. I don't want to give anyone a very, very easy route. I want Portugal and uh, Castile to stick to this side of the New World. Right, colonists will arrive in 80 days. Cool. This colony is almost finished as well. I can grab these easy ones as well. I think it's this one actually. Yep. Yeah. Sail tone. Strong 100 population. So, yeah, so far this. the campaign is going better than what I expected. No, I'm not going to share my maps with Portugal. I didn't mind seeding these provinces here. It made my nation look ugly anyway. Maybe I should ally myself with Brittany. Oh, he's already allied with France, so okay. He's he's being protected, that's all good. Here we go. Yep. I knew it. About five ducats a month we're losing. So that's, uh, that's not too bad. I might be able to run another pr uh, colony. Just for the meantime, and then go back to two or three. Where are all of our merchants, actually? There's one steering trade here, steering trade here, and where is the third one? I do have three, right? Uh, merchant in the North Sea, merchant in Lubick. That's fine. Yep, that's all good, I think. There's no trade value up here just yet, so... I won't need to send anyone up there. Extra prestige, yes please. Although I don't like losing ducats. This 
colony is going to be done very, very soon. And we are definitely going to have the majority of the trade power here. If we can grab this one and this one, it's done. That's it. William the Third Tudor has died. Sorry, no. What am I talking about? The William the Third Tudor uh, will now rule our nation. Uh, it doesn't say who died, actually. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, whatever. Hey, well, this guy's a really good ruler. Uh, 635. So that's really, really nice. We have corruption for some reason, so let's stop that. Now we're losing eight, eight up, uh, about eight ducats a month. A noble heir with three four uh, to the three four four becomes heir lose a uh, weak claim. I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. Um, I don't think he'll die anytime soon. So do we have? Yes, we have royal uh, marriages with everyone, so that's good. And there we go. Is that our? Yeah, and he's absolutely terrible. Good queen consort, but a one four three. That's that's shocking. Okay, that colony is now done. Okay, we have our colonist. No, the colonist isn't there. Colonist is here. No, what? Jamaica's grown very quickly. Wow, okay. Where are our colonies? colonists? There's one. Where is the next? Oh, okay, there it is. So we'll grab... Oh, someone's already starting to colonize this. I knew it. Gonzalo de Lavia, that's definitely Castile. 100%, yep. Puerto Rico is now self-sustaining. Okay, let's just continue to grab this. This is Puerto Rico, I believe. No, but it's completed. Portugal wants us to come to the war in of Ifni against Sus. Sure, why not? I will help. Okay, let's go send him up here. Put the troop in Havana. Exploration once again is done. South Atlantic Sea. This one's done as well. I think we can afford one more. But... I think we might start on Chesterpeak Bay. Just so we can send a message to Castile, tell them to get out of our territory. This is my lane. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm. Take away the colonist here. And send him here. Money lose aggressiveness or money gain more money gain aggressiveness. We'll take the more money. I always like money. Money is very good in this game. And in general, actually. That's, that's just a general statement to be said. <laughs> Brittany declared war on who? Provence. Provence is allied with nobody. So Brittany is going to take this land, which might anger France a little bit, I have a feeling. Because I think France is definitely, that that's one of their provinces of interest. Lose army tradition, gain professionalism, lose loyalty, gain tradition. That's yeah, fine. Speaking of which, clicks, 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 no click, no click, no clicks. It's all good. These guys have stopped drilling and we're still paying for our forts. Let's stop doing that. And our colony in Africa is nearly, nearly done. I think I'll leave this episode here, guys. If you, did, if you guys did enjoy the episode, please um, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and the bell button to keep notified of any future videos. Have a good one.